Are you tired of losing to the latest gold and glitter? Ever wanted to show off to your friends that you could clear Conundrum 12? Do you not want to grind hours and hours of hidden layers of blessings RNG? Why not just get them all? We have discovered a glitch that can allow players to get both occurrences of Ramme guaranteed 100% of the time every single time. Hey guys, Mr. Pokey here, back with another video. And today, this is gonna be a really, really quick one. This has just been brought to me by one of my viewers. Shout out to Mocking K. Thank you for bringing this up. Where essentially, we have discovered from the CN community that we could exploit this glitch within Hongkai Star Rose Gold and Glitter to ensure that we get both instances of Run May every single time whenever we play gold and glitter i'll teach you guys exactly how you can go ahead and use this i'm not sure if this was intended maybe mihoyo patches this one day but until that day happens this glitch or bug or whatever you call it is working i have tested it out for the past three runs of simulated universe and every single time i managed to get both occurrences of Run May. so without further ado let's get into today's content So the principle of this glitch is very very interesting which is you guys have noticed we have been getting this purple notes known as abnormally or abnormal events where if you enter you get a chance to get a random occurrence from this happening right now we have discovered that there is 17 total different random occurrences uh, what players need to do to essentially guarantee the rame is that they have to go through every single one of these occurrence at least one time and once every single occurrence has been cleared by the player you are now guaranteed to get rame after doing the either three choose one selection or the double selection right the double occurrence or the three choose one all of these 17 occurrences two of which are repeatable events and these two events are basically the uh, cheat code as well as the honey right for the cheat code you always have to choose the 100 blessings which is the first option because if you do not pick this option then the next time you face this you will enter into a battle then the glitch or the bug wouldn't work anymore so always always pick this but the moment you encounter this on the very first time do not encounter it again because like i mentioned the cheat code as well as the cocktail these two blessings um these two occurrences rather they are repeated occurrences once you go through them once do not go back to them again so that you can get to every single possible blessing so this is for the cheat code and another one over here as you can see this is for the cocktail right you always choose the sweet cocktail because if you don't choose a sweet cocktail um then you might get this pretty messed up blessing which is uh really 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 bad right so just 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 don't choose it right so here's exactly what you do uh the path you can choose pretty much any path you want it really doesn't matter any path works here uh the dice you want to choose the hunt dice from the second option over here because the hunt dice allows you to travel to uh, basically more distances right so it makes your life a little bit easier you can move between domains a little bit faster then after selecting the hunt domain take note of the blessings over here um these are the blessings that you guys need to basically make this glitch work um not really to make this glitch work, but it will enable us to go through all um 17 different occurrences so as long as the word says copy you go ahead and take it right uh, i'll leave up the english version up here after i edited this video but basically just choose every single thing that lets you copy another one is the enhance which turns the occurrence into either the times two rewards or the three choose one and for the final blessing uh it honestly doesn't matter you could go to the speed buff you go to the tech buff uh, that will not affect us getting rame at all right so once this setup has been achieved then players can go ahead and start the battle right for the battle you ideally want to choose the cheat chance or the curios uh, because you want to get as many dice rolls as possible cheat chance would be pretty ideal since you can use it to uh guarantee that you start the battle with either the times two rewards or the three choose one rewards or the golden rewards that you can copy all the occurrences of the place right so either the cheat chance or if there's no cheat chance then go ahead and choose the curio option the curio option ideally you want to get the curio option that gives you the dice roll the four dice rolls um yep this is the two things that you gotta take right the one that gives you a cheat chance or the one that gives you the four rerolls that is essentially it so ideally you want to start off the battle with the abnormal things near you the purple notes near you so that uh, when you actually enter the purple notes there's a chance that you can copy them all over the place but it doesn't really matter as you guys can see from my run that i'll be posting right here uh i didn't really start off with a very optimal start uh basically the purple notes are all over the place but 
after a while, I managed to do the cheat rolls, get myself to get the double rewards and then copy the double rewards to all of the place. And eventually, you ideally want to go through roughly um, as many occurrences as possible in the first place. Ideally, you can hit 10 different occurrences. Uh, this can be achieved by basically five different purple nodes with the times two icon, right? So once you got a times two, uh, basically just keep copying them all of the place, right? Copy, copy, copy. The name of the thing is just keep copying. And essentially, at the end of the way, you can see that the, the CM player managed to get to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12 different occurrence before the very first plane even ended. Um, but like I mentioned, there are a total of 17 occurrences two of which are repeating. So basically you gotta get to all 17, right? So once this has been established, the next time you get into the battle, um, so this is basically what I've been going through. Um, next time you go to the second plane, uh, just do exactly what you have been doing. This time you don't really need to copy the double. You can choose either the three plus one or the double and, and just keep getting into these uh, occurrences, essentially. I keep getting into these abnormal events. And essentially after clearing um, all of the 17 occurrences or the 14 occurrences um then you will essentially end up with run me and this run me will only appear if you have the three choose one or the double rewards if you do not have the three choose one or double rewards as you can see over here then it will just keep giving you the the, the cheat chance right uh, where you have to choose the uh, 100 cures it will never appear unless you get this so either get the three choose one or the double and then once that domain has the three choose one or the double you enter and then after clearing all of the current stages, you will 100% of the time um, face these two things, right? You will 100% of the time face these two uh, runway stages. And once you got these two runway stages, you essentially just win the game, right? You're always going to be guaranteed these two runway stages. Uh, you want to get the all blessings as well as the 2000 universal shots. Uh, of course, this option is only limited to if your team has runway. So ideally, you want to run runway with your team so you can get this uh, bonus uh, path essentially, right? So get the all blessings first with the 2000 shots then after getting the all blessings with 2000 shots then you get the second occurrence which is uh, enhance all current blessings as well as uh 10 curios and 10 cheat chances right so get the blessings first then you enhance everything so once this two has been established uh it's essentially easy mode right it doesn't you don't really need to care about what you get then just keep clearing through all the content and eventually you reach the final boss enhance everything and you just beat the crap out of everything really short video i would say i just really wanted to get this across to you guys as soon as possible because this has just been discovered uh, roughly a couple of hours beforehand unfortunately i was at work so i couldn't give it to you guys so uh, all the best in trying to replicate this glitch uh it really works 100 percent of the time as long as you know what you're doing right uh, get as many of the abnormal events as possible copy the double at the first plane and then at the second plane either the double or the three choose one and eventually you will end up with both rame occurrences right so hope this helps your gold and glitter grind and yeah that's all i have for today's content and i'll see you guys next time take care i i, I genuinely cannot believe this shit i genuinely cannot believe this shit i genuinely i genuinely cannot believe this shit guys i just did I say I genuinely, I, did I say how I genuinely cannot believe this shit? I genuinely cannot believe this shit, guys.